Jam fam, we are celebrating our annual holiday giveaway show. And when my team asked me what was on my wish list for this hour, well, I said beautiful Christmas music was at the top of the list because holiday songs, to me, it's just a gift. I love walking into the home and it's piping through. It just reminds me of how special this time is. And our next guest is a three-time Grammy nominee who started her career at just 16 years old in her family's gospel group, Forever Jones. And she's earned seven Dove Award nominations, including one for New Artist of the Year for 2022. Jo Jones is gifting her fans a tour for her first solo album titled Clarity, released this year to rave reviews. She's here to spread some holiday cheer. Let's give it up for award-winning gospel artist Jo Jones! Hello. Have a seat. What a year! What a year it's yes. been for you. All of these nominations and yeah. accolades. How does yeah. it feel? How do you describe it? I'm so thankful. Uh -huh. And um, getting nominated at the Doves and the Grammys, it was, we got album of the year, gospel album of the year. So for me, that speaks to my team. So it just felt like they got what they deserved as well because we, we have been working hard for a while. Well, they so say I just a rising so tide lifts all boats. Yes. And everybody in your boat is rising <laughs> Absolutely. there. Absolutely. Um, yeah. But you know, I was reading an interview and you talked about a lot of the success came after you decided, I have to be authentic and true to me. You had to find your North Star. I did. Um, and it was a long journey of me just waiting and, and being in this process of like, Trusting God, yeah. you know? It's hard and, to think about faith if you're not having to trust yourself. But here's the thing though, you can't sing about faith unless your faith has been tested. That's right. And, right? That's right. So I had to go through my own season of being tested. And I'm, I'm so forever grateful for that because it allows me to relate to people and I have a, another level of depth that I didn't have before. You talked about in the past that this is an answer that you were waiting for. You turned down record deals. I and did. And finally, you waited for that clarity. Yeah. And the yes, the title of your <laughs> album. What was that yeah. like? Because so many people wonder, you know, how do you decide to stand still and wait for the things that you are praying for? It is on a decision by decision basis, really. You know, one thing comes and you say, I'm gonna pray about this and you feel a no and you gotta go with that. And um, for me, it was uprooting this fear of missing out. I had to make peace with that and no, I'm not what gonna miss out. What were you worried that you were gonna miss out on? On life, on my life. You know, you, you wanna just take ambition and say, let's do this. I'm gonna kick down every door I can. But uh, that just wasn't my journey. I really wanted it to be the right moment, the right timing, the right opportunity. So I prayed about everything. And, and when it was time to say yes, it was also scary. There was growth in each journey for me. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. I love the album.